A new at 10, more than 78,000 bottles of beer gone in seconds. Now, the massive hops heist happened early this morning at the Sweetwater Brewery plant just north of downtown Atlanta. And Fox Size Denise Dillon is live at the company tonight. So, Denise, these brew burglars took off with two trailer loads full of beer? That's right, trailers just like this one, 53 feet long and inside plenty of beer, more than 3,000 cases. It's like 80,000 beers. Yeah. That's a lot. That's a big party weekend. Those beers swiped from Sweetwater Brewing Company in Atlanta by thirsty thieves. More than 3,000 cases were loaded on a couple of trailers ready to roll out. But sometime in the dark of night, thieves pulled up, hooked up two of the trailers, and slipped away with the suds. You know, we're talking 3,000 cases, so $90,000 worth of beer. I don't know what plans these guys had for it, but that's a lot of beer. The trailers were found ditched at separate locations in South Atlanta and Clayton County. Both of which were empty when they were found, unfortunately. A short time later, about a fourth of the beer was discovered at a warehouse in Conley, Georgia. No sign of the rest of the brew. There are 10 pallets of sweet water sitting on the dock with a blue tarp over the top of them. Employees here at the brewery will be working overtime to make up for the stolen beer to ensure there's no shortage, especially with the July 4th holiday just around the corner. You know, it's not like, you know, there's plenty more to sit in the tank. We've got to make more beer, and that's a two week process at best in order for us to replenish all that. Now, company officials are hoping to find the rest of the beer, but beer lovers, you are not going to like what I'm going to tell you they're going to do with that beer if and when they find it. I'm putting together that part of the story right now. I'll have it for you tonight at 11 on The Edge. Reporting live in Northeast Atlanta, Denise Dillon, Fox 5 News. All right. Thank you, Denise. We'll see you on The Edge.